Hello everybody, welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077, where last time I progressed Goro Takemura's questline, we met with his uh, mentor or partner or co-worker, whatever you want to call it, Oda, and he didn't kill us, thankfully, and uh, Goro said that it went very well despite uh, Oda's attitude and that he will think about what we told him and all that. And also I finished the quest I had forgotten about, Sandra Dorset and uh, Cyberbank or something like that, and we told her that we looked in it and we were proud of your work. Now we're supposed to get a call from uh, Goro anytime soon, maybe? Maybe after we teleport, I don't know. But I also discovered that we have a few quests that are not marked on the map, killing the name of or uh, whatever it's called will not be available after we progress the Hemura quest line. Sending the clouds looks like it's available now. So let's call Bozo. No, no, Takemura called call. P? Yes. Information from Okada-san. Very valuable. I also learned something through my own efforts. Cool, what's that? We must meet. Where will it be this time? Trash processing plant? Deserted <sighs> in-card station? No need to be snide, V. There is a street market. It is on the footbridge above the main street. Mm -hmm. The elevators. It is easy to get lost. I'm oh. on my way there. Do not make me wait. Oh, I will make me wait a bit because maybe I should call Bozo or should I visit you right away? Okay, okay, let's visit Goro right away and do Bozo's thing afterwards or sometime in the future. So, where is he? He is there. Okay, see you in a moment. Oh, and Goro sent us a message. Meet him at the bazaar or something. I don't know, I missed it. Uh, let's open it. Bazaar, Kanzaki Street, Japan Town. You cannot miss it. Bazaar is on the upper level, quite high, so it's worth using the public elevator. I think there are two. Uh, no, okay, let's, let's not tell him that. Okay, I will. Nothing more to say. Cool, cool. Um... And where is this alleged elevator? I don't know. Maybe we shouldn't be walking on the street? Maybe. It's a bit hard to traverse the city, but thankfully the minibap does a good work with that. Oh my, it's really up high, eh? Okay, okay, we found our way. Cool, cool. Oh no, oh no, there it is, there it is. There, there, he's right over there, probably eating something again. Oh no, he's not. There he is. Go over the plan with Takimura. Where is he? Goro? I just see police here. Oh, you are here. I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Ah. Uh, Things are heating up in the... Ah, uh, I need to borrow him, yeah. He's got the no. gift of the gap. Can't be denied. But I need to steal your buddy for a sec. What are you? Goro, it's it's better to do it my way here. Good to see you. As it is to see you, V. So... I acquired some information of my own. Tell me about it. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His son, I guess. His murderer. Yeah. The irony makes me sick. Okay, parade stands to confirm his legitimacy, yeah. Your Nobu's a smart little muffin. Putting on the parade to show off his attachment to Arasaka, its values, and to solidify his legitimacy. Yeah, probably. He is shrewd. I will not deny that. Japanese heritage is one element. Yorinobu will also put on a display of power. Exactly that. The floats are sure to be beautiful, but the wise and the I will see in them a hero. Yeah, I'm here, I'm powerful. Doesn't matter that my father died. I am here, Gumin Domo. Yeah. Watch your backs. Not one for subtlety, is he? Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Tell me about it. Look to the sky. Okay. I did. I did. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. Uh huh. If I could just get onto Hanako sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Cool. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. Without your enhancements? Expectations way too high, Goro. Couldn't pull that off even if you still had your fancy implants. I have thought of a solution. 
and what would While that be? You are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. Sorry, dude, I had they to work. They all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepared. And you want me to sneak in and to break yeah. into the compound, find the right float, and inject a virus into its system. Cool, I can do you that. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. And the actually sounds doable, yeah. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need. I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shot. I thought you would. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Okay, where did you get it? Where'd you get this short? Across the canal. Mm hmm. Kabuki. <laughs> Might actually be half decent soft then. And if it isn't, got a few tricks up my sleeve too. This is good to know. All right, let's do this. Let us move on. Yeah. You over the plan? I'm trying. Where are you taking me? Control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me. The snipers especially. I can put them to sleep. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. Mm -hmm. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. Yes, can good. deal with them as I advance. Okay, sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. I won't ask you why you want me to do all the you dead work. Just like that, the risks are considerable. Yeah, well. Get more and more used to exactly. that. Exactly. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shard. All right. The camera control room is in front of us. There? You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. Cool. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch How it. very honorable of you. Now, get to it. Most people need to touch alcohol during work to function, but that's a story for another time. Okay, we can force this open. Riverward, Randy says hi. Uh, you visit him at the hospital, what he think? Uh, yeah, let's open the full versions of these. What do you think of your gift? Loved it actually, I mentioned it was your idea. Don't hesitate, hit me up whenever you need. Randy knows he can count on me, that's what matters. No, no, go with the first one. By the way, I was at the hospital and met the parents of those two boys who had said for them farm. They wanted me to thank you. Good to know they're recovering. Same we managed to save only two of them. No, no, let's not play on his guild anymore. Oh, and I also met with Yawen. You know, the one from the lab. I know, the one who's your ex. Exactly. Uh, reigniting the old fella, am are we? Don't know about that. I feel like too much is happening uh, right now to even consider it. I thanked her for helping us with Harris. She risked her job back then, sent her regards. Good luck with that uh, river. She seemed like one of the good ones. Yeah. Time will tell. Keep your fingers crossed anyway. I'll see you around. Cool, cool. That's another thing out of the way. Let's for this door open. As if nobody's watching. Let's get there. This surprisingly empty control room, security room, whatever you want to call it. Let's let's steal everything and anything and yeah, install the software. Cool cool. Of course it did. We trust Goro. Goro is cool. So, mate. And? What do you think? Done. System's ours. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. Let's get to the hard to part. break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... We should eat something? Yeah, obviously. Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. It's on me, mate. Don't worry. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. 
See you tomorrow. Okay, then. Can we eat? Oh, Johnny. I can't believe I'm saying this, but this sock of scum might actually... Yeah, he's a cool dude, mate. He's a well-trained dog. Needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flat... Well, not necessarily. Uh, let's... Let's try a bite. And he's not a bad guy, yeah. Johnny. He's soccer scum to you, I know that. But Garo's not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. He was Saburo fucking Arasaka's body. And that automatically makes him a bad guy? Obviously not, but don't have to off him. What is this? Ah, uh, crap. It's food, mate. Come on. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half. We I like your floor. progress there. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Cool. Three, I get onto the float. Or we Four, die. I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Cool. Five Oda Zero Rush. got five. Oda zeroes us and pisses on our corpses. You will never be less than a foot away from Hanako. Oda would not dare raise his hand against. What about me, though? About me. That is a different matter. I would advise you to watch your distance. And not kill him if it comes down to punches. Have another bite? Mmm, it's good. Goro, you should eat more. And eat the last of it. Just to piss him off. Okay. Uh, Dan Dumber seen that this before. Really have to get us killed? No, no, no. The well, first one. Sounds like a suicide run, but Dan Dumber shit than this, so. Things are even more stupid. Than no, no, uh, from actually, that was my pick of. Uh, yet, yeah, <laughs> exactly. Bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Okay. Reconnaissance is required. You will call me. Uh, yeah, let me help. Stranger in a strange land. I'm going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Thank you. Agreed. This we will do together. Cool. Oh, there he is. Louder! Louder! Your Inova. Okay, you want to kill him. Or in the TV. He eliminated the last obstacle between himself and the complete power. They surrendered it to him. Obviously. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last. And it crumbled to dust by that guy. From the inside. Yeah. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. So. Okay, old man's death could have couldn't have helped, yeah. Old man's death must have really fed the flames between the different factions. That is exactly what happened. Mm -hmm. What's the balance of power look like now? Bad. Kiji longs for stability. The old order. They are united behind. Oh, Hanas. so we're cool with them. The liberal wing, Hato, support Michiko-sama, Saburo's granddaughter. I know a little about her. Ah, uh, me too. And then there is Taka, treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Mm -hmm. Not to mention even smaller factions. Tell me about them some other time. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, where did he get his rebellious streak from? Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon I shall ask him in person. Mm hmm. Okay, why did Saburo allow all of this to happen though? Why did Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment. He showed a weak. I mean, it was his son. For his daughter. Oh. 
when Yorino formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family. Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one war. Yet he didn't because Hanako told him not, not to, okay? He did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorino returned, his tail between his legs. I see. Persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Yeah, I understand, I understand. Uh, might have a change of heart now. Do you blame Hanako for this too? Wait, you think she's complicit in Saburo's murder? I think we are all to blame. We allowed ourselves Ooh, to drink. Tell me about it. But we will correct this soon. Cool. Will you join me? Of course. Sure, why not? I Let have completed most of here. the quests, so yeah. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So dust and plastic. <laughs> okay. Oh, and we teleport there. Here we are at the industrial park. I have found a good place to observe. Okay, let's let's observe then. Is it up there? I guess so. We must just climb up here. Cool. You climb, I jump. Now this way. Lead the way, mate. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here. Oh geez, what luck. Rancho Coronado. And the elevator is working. That's cool, that's cool. Roof. So... Uh, you didn't seem to like the food you had last time. Want to try, I don't know, some Mediterranean cuisine? No? Okay. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If the city if, didn't look like crap. If there was anything to admire. <laughs> exactly. Eight night city, that much. I mean, dude, come on. Perhaps I am simply homesick, as you say. No, no, night city now, is crap. You must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Cool, Perhaps so... We cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. Okay, let's get to it then. You'll have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Mm -hmm. Shall we begin? Yeah, so... Uh, let's do this, let's yeah. Let's do this. And nobody's detecting us. That's, that's cool. Scan the area. But we have this bridge over here. Footbridge, but it's guarded. Not the best way to get in. There's no other way. Cool. Next up, this transformer here. Transformer by the wall. See it? We should use it to step up. I mean, can we go in through the front door? Have those thingies down there? Great. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. Okay, nothing more you want to say about it. An antenna. Antenna. Security hub is liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. Ooh. This is not bad. No, I've never said it was, but okay. Get, get security system. Yeah, it's uh, guarded. Flash turrets by the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. Me neither. Ah, uh, the big uh, satellite. This is. Got eyes on the comm system. It's a lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. That would be cool. And have the pipes, pipes. there. See him? Ooh, and the van. We could use them to get inside. Okay, what about that van, though? Trucks come in regularly, yeah. Are we to hijack one? Would be easy. Anything else to scan? And maybe this is, uh, yeah, the van 
situation would be better since we have the corpo choices. Maybe we can sweet talk our way in. I think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. You sure about that? So, we going in? Hmm. It is what you said before entering a compact place. Uh, pretty much, yeah. I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. How long? If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in. in. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. Mm hmm. And skip ahead. Yeah. <coughs> I'm dying. B. What? what? Oh, you're finally eating something. No sudden movements. Oh, a cat. Do you see it? Yes. That cat. I uh, thought they all disappeared from the city, yeah. I'm looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. I love cats. Can we scan it? It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches. Technically, roaches are insects. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight long. Yeah, cats are cool, mate. Perhaps it is a bacaneco. A uh, neko means cat, but bake? A bacaneco? What's that? Something like a it demon? A spirit, yeah. Spirit. It brings misfortune, can restore the dead back to life. Uh huh. Uh, do you believe in ghosts? Believe in ghosts? The relic let you talk to the dead, does it not? I believe we are past. It belief. actually also brought me back from the dead. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune. Oh. Kappa, Bakeneko. That would be interesting. Care to share some of the stories? Where'd you grow up, anyway? I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once when I was desperate to leave there, I... Yes? You joined Arasaka, we get it. Ah, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. Ah, oh, that's actually kind of cool. My childhood? Let's see. Night spent looking for a star, any star, all dimmed by city lights. Silent lullabies sung by the flickering neon signs of Charter Hill. You are sounding too much like a song, V. I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Oh, that doesn't sound healthy. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children. But only the clean ones. Okay, military transporters for a slum? Transporters, you say? Armored and armed. Chiva 11 has the most murders in all Japan. Oh, so you grew up street tough. It probably still has. Okay, they recruited you for military service. Yes. So they could turn them into Corvo soldiers? Exactly. Mm -hmm. When they chose me, I felt I had won. Until you went there, actually, and saw the truth. Army, I was given everything I lacked before: discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. Mm hmm. How did you come to be Saburo's bodyguard, though? I mean, up so high. So how's a corporal rookie go from cleaning latrines to being Saburo Arasaka's bodyguard? The highest grades at the academy. Serves in the special forces, and Arasaka-sama's unmatched eye for talent. I'm guessing that last one was 50%, and the first two was 25, 25 each. To make the right decisions with imperfect knowledge, that is how you become the world's most powerful man. Ooh, more truth to that. 100 candidates standing at attention. And Arasaka-sama looked into each of our souls and chose the one who would serve him best. And you happen to be that one. All you had to do was kill Arasaka's enemies. Anything good, anything's good that puts food on the table. Eh, not exactly. Uh, but let's go with this one. What you had to to keep from going hungry. I sense that you No! And yet you have no I'm not right. being just mental, I'm being understanding. Unlike you and your friend Mr. Wells. I was not arrogant. I did not take these. Yeah, we paths. get it. You worked for it. I'm not judging you, though. Wasn't judging you. And true, you oppose the corporations, their order, their world, 
in a mindless way, yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corpse. Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying. Splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists, as if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability? You know, I used to Safe work for Arasaka. Slum rats? They're there, scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that too. Huh? What do we have to say to that? Fix everything at once. I'm sure we're past the point that we can fix anything at all. You forget I work for Arasaka, yeah. Forget and I was at Arasaka. Saw how corpse operate. It wasn't roses and rainbows. And you know what? Nobody owns me. I'm free. You should try it. That doesn't work out for anyone, everyone, V. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world. Forget everything. I mean, I have uh, people in that particular area of expertise. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. Yeah, but also hunger is the best of motivations, mate. Do you know what I think? No. What's that? That day in Compeki, we both have lost someone important. Mm, yeah, and that's not, not peace hidden. Peace. So we seek conflict, argue eagerly. No, I just want to get this fucker out of my head. Finally started to make some sense. It is the duty of the living to atone for the dead. Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. I sure hope so. Make sure we die for good. Also that. The Bakaneko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As cats do. As will we. Oh, I guess so. I think it is time to do something. Hmm? I guess so. I mean, I will finish the episode right about oh, here. Fuck, get worse. You do not look so bad. Um, I am, trust me. Return to street level. Okay, we'll return to street level and finish off the episode there. Let's see if Goro has something else to say. We will meet Osanta and Street. I'm waiting by the construction site. It's visible from the distance. See you soon. Okay, then. I'm guessing he doesn't have anything else to say until we get down there. Cool, cool. So, we progressed his mission, Gimme Danger, and nothing that interesting except a few, well, quite interesting conversations and all that, and we have to infiltrate that Arasaka factory uh, to progress further. But I'm going to do that next time because it's going to be a bit long, and if we need some filler for that, I have a couple of missions at the ready to do so yeah i'll close off this episode right here thank you everybody so very much for watching i will see you all in the next one until then stay safe and have fun